Hi, I'm Dazzling Daryl from Bunbury Farmers Market where we have extreme value and extreme freshness. And I'm Terrific Terry and Daryl's got something very special for us today. That's right, I'm making a fun guy pasta. Fun guy? That's right. Fun guy. Daryl, you're a bit of a fun guy. Particularly when I go to a party, but I've got mushrooms in it. Ah, fun guy. Fun That's guy. That's right. There we okay. go. Okay, well, You've crank. it all now. That's Thank right. <laughs> crank the wok, get that nice and hot. We've got our Mancini ravioli, the chicken one, a mm -hmm. WA product from Calmscott. Very, very good. No added colours in that. Really good handmade product. Okay, so we've got a, a packet of that. Yes. Get the wok nice and hot. And you want to add mushrooms first? Yeah, yep, welly boot. The welly boot. Just a little bit. There we go. <laughs> Let that start to smoke up a little bit uh -huh. there. Just give it a swirl, swirl around. Because your mushrooms, are, they sup up the oil anyway. They, do. Yep. they certainly do. Okay, yeah. And yep. we're using our beautiful field mushrooms. Field today. mushrooms yes. and that, yeah. So I'll put that in there. A lot of flavour in your field mushrooms. There we go. There we are. And it's a bit of salt and pepper. We'll put that in there. Just a little yeah, dash of little salt and pepper. pepper. There we go, yep. See, the, the, it's yes. supping up the oil. Definitely. Nice, nutty flavour. And then next, if you put a bit of butter, that mm -hmm. brings out the flavour of the mushrooms and okay. it'll sup that up. There we go. Just mix that through. Mm. And then all those nice flavours. The mushrooms will start to emit a lot of moisture shortly. Yes. Yep. And if you want to put the leeks, we've got probably a cup of those in there. Yeah, it's actually about one full reasonable sized yep. leek. Yep. And I, I use leeks because they've got that nice little mild sweet flavour. Yeah. Uh, beautiful. It's looking really good now. Mm, those mushrooms are just they starting are to... They are just starting to... Um, sweat, I think sweat you call it. Sweat them off. Yes. That's it. Don't be scared to use the heat because that'll um, get yep. it going very, very well. Yeah. Give that a bit of a toss, toss. through there. Yep. I Look think at you that. do better actually doing that than yeah. you do stirring, Daryl. I'm always <laughs> stirring, you know that. <laughs> Okay, that's looking really good. And some bacon, pre-cooked bacon. I've used our new um, free range one. That's a yeah. really good princey. Yes. That's a WA product too. Really good natural one. And what I did is I cooked it in the oven. Uh, you can drain off any extra fat that may be on it and then chop it up and it makes a great addition. And also it stops it from sticking in the it wok does. or the pan, which is good. Okay, that's looking really good now. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Okay, right. We've got some um, cooked pasta, the ravioli. Yep. Our mancini. Mancini, we'll put that in there. Beautiful, look at that. Give and that you a mix. You don't need to cook it for too long, no. either, do you, Daryl? Three no. minutes yeah. from the boil. Mm. And then we've got beautiful grape tomatoes. I put the grape tomatoes because yep. they're sweet. Oh, beautiful and, and sweet. And it adds a wonderful colour. Colour, there we go. I just chop them in half, just make them go a bit further. And then I'll put a little bit of garlic in there now. Is there a Mix reason through. why you add the garlic toward the end? Now? Towards the end. If you, I don't, I don't want to cook out too much of the flavour because yeah. this is a more natural uh, flavoured dish with not, yeah. you know, you're relying on the natural of your um, yeah. vegetable and garlic yeah. and all that sort of thing to fuse in. Because if it, if yeah. it cooks out too much, you won't get you won't the full flavour. And and to note that it doesn't have a cream sauce. So. That's right. That's yes. dead right. For a change. For a change, yeah. that's right. Okay, <laughs> put some um, parsley in that. Yeah. Flat it's, leaf. It's important to add the parsley toward the end as well because you want it to retain that vibrant colour. That's right. And the flavour. It's beautiful. Yeah. We're pretty generous. We've got about a cup. That's it. Look at that. Magnificent mm. colours. Mm. And if you pass the bowl over, I'll dish that up. Okay. And I've got one just behind you there to do that. And then we'll add the cheese on the last minute. Well. Pecorino. Oh, yes. Beautiful. Good flavour. Borello. It is. It, it is. is. Yeah. It's a lovely cheese, the Borello Pecorino. Just gives that little bit of taste. It's a little bit like a parmesan, a little softer than parmesan, it's but mm -mm, it's very special cheese. And it's not too strong, just that nice no. little sharpness to it. Look at that. Oh, that's looking good. And wonderful. this goes a long way. You could feed probably about six people yeah. with this. Six generous serves. Mm. 
I like go. the natural look that Daryl got this time. It is good. Ve it's good. Very good. Very uh, rustic. <laughs> rustic. There we go. Look at that. Put a bit of pecorino on there. Have well. a try. And you've still got more in the wok. That's yeah, right. It does go a long way. And then you've got to try it. Oh dear, this is going to be such a drama. <laughs> party, <isn't it? laughs> That's right. There we go. I'll dish a bit of that up for you. Oh, thanks. Just so. careful, it's fairly warm. It is. Got but the that's cheese. Okay. Ooh. A little bit of the tomato. A bit of tomato, that's right. And you've got oh. a little bit of bacon there. Good mixture of everything. Thanks, Daryl. Isn't he a gentleman? Thank you. Oh. I don't know if I can fit the ravioli in my <laughs> the mouth. The whole lot, that's else. right. All those mixtures of flavours. Mmm. Mmm, that fragrance is good too. And the ravioli. And, and you're right about the garlic. I can still smell the that garlic. That last, not last minute. Isn't Ooh. that ravioli good? It is, and that parsley. Mm. It's beautiful. Mm. Gives it that nice fresh flavour at the end. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Pecorino. Daryl, you are a fun guy, and it is Thank absolutely you. fabulous. So mm. come into Bunbury Farmers Market. We're open seven days a week. All our beautiful fresh produce straight from our grower to you at home.